Dear friend, I want to speak directly to your heart today because I know that life can be incredibly challenging. You might be dealing with physical pain that weighs you down every day, emotional turmoil that feels like a storm raging inside, or a deep spiritual struggle that leaves you feeling lost and distant from God. Whatever it is that you're facing, I want you to know that you are not alone in this battle. You are seen, you are known, and you are deeply loved by the Creator of the universe. God sees every tear you've cried, every sleepless night you've endured, and every ounce of strength you've used just to make it through the day. He is fully aware of the pain that's in your heart, the confusion in your mind, and the weariness in your soul. And more than just seeing your pain, He feels it too. The Bible tells us that God is not distant or detached from our suffering. He is right there with you, walking through the valley with you, holding you close when you feel like you can't take another step. The scriptures are overflowing with promises that remind us of God's unwavering commitment to heal and restore us. He is a God who never leaves us to struggle on our own. His word assures us time and again that He is our refuge, our strength, and our ever-present help in times of trouble. Whether you're facing a mountain of physical illness, a sea of emotional distress, or a desert of spiritual dryness, God's promises are like a bomb for your soul, bringing comfort, hope, and the assurance that He is in control. God's love for you is beyond measure, and His desire is to see you whole and healed in every aspect of your life. He doesn't just care about one part of you, He cares about all of you, your body, your mind, and your spirit. He is a compassionate Father who longs to bring you into a place of peace, rest, and restoration. So take heart, dear friend, and know that in the midst of your pain, God is with you, and He is working all things together for your good. Trust in His love, lean on His promises, and hold on to the hope that He is bringing healing and restoration to your life. In Jeremiah 30 verse 17, God declares, But I will restore you to health and heal your wounds. This isn't just a promise made long ago to a distant people, it's a personal assurance from God to you right here and right now. It's a promise that reaches across time and space, touching your life with the same power and love that God has always shown to His people. Whatever wounds you carry, whether they are physical pains that you struggle with daily, emotional scars that linger from past hearts, or spiritual battles that weigh heavily on your heart, know that God sees them all and He is fully capable of bringing you the healing you need. God's healing is not just about physical restoration, it encompasses every aspect of your life. He is concerned about the pain that you may be carrying in your heart, the anxieties that trouble your mind, and the spiritual struggles that make you feel distant from Him. He is Jehovah Rapha, the Lord who heals you, Exodus 15 verse 26, and His healing touch is powerful enough to reach into every corner of your being. He doesn't just want to heal one part of you, He longs to heal every part of you, your body, your mind, and your spirit. This name, Jehovah Rapha, reveals God's very nature as a healer. It's not just something He does, it's who He is. He is the great physician, the one who mends what is broken, restores what is lost, and brings wholeness where there is pain. His desire is to take your wounds, no matter how deep or how long they have been there, and to bring you to a place of complete restoration. So take hold of this promise today. Let it sink into your heart and give you hope. Trust that God is at work in your life, bringing healing and restoration in ways that you might not even see yet. He is faithful and He is with you, ready to heal every wound and restore you to health. When you feel overwhelmed by your circumstances, when the weight of your pain and struggles feels too heavy to bear, remember that God is not distant or detached from your suffering. Psalm 34 verse 18 gives us a beautiful and comforting truth, the Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. This verse is a powerful reminder that in your moments of deepest despair, God is not far off. He is right there beside you, fully aware of your pain and ready to lift you up. His presence is a constant source of strength, offering comfort when your heart feels shattered and your spirit feels crushed. God's closeness is not just a comforting idea, it is a promise that He will actively work to mend your broken heart and restore your spirit. 
He sees every tear, hears every cry, and understands the depths of your pain. And in his infinite love and compassion, he reaches out to you, offering healing that goes beyond what any human can provide. He is the ultimate healer, not only of our bodies, but of our hearts and souls as well. You can trust him to take the pieces of your brokenness and weave them together into something beautiful and whole. Jesus Christ, during his time on earth, demonstrated this profound love and compassion through his healing ministry. He didn't just heal the sick to prove his divine power, he healed because his heart was moved with love and compassion for those who were suffering. Every miracle he performed was a testament to his deep care for each individual, showing that their pain mattered to him, and so does yours. Jesus didn't just see the crowds, he saw each person, just as he sees you right now. In Matthew 11 verse 28, Jesus extends a personal invitation to you, Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. This is not just an offer, it is a heartfelt plea from the Savior who knows your struggles and longs to carry your burdens. Whether you are weighed down by physical pain, emotional distress, or spiritual exhaustion, Jesus invites you to come to him. He wants to take those burdens, your pain, your anxiety, your fear, and replace them with his peace, comfort, and rest. So, when the world feels overwhelming and your heart feels heavy, remember that Jesus is there offering you rest and healing. He is the Prince of Peace, the one who can calm the storm in your soul and bring you to a place of rest. Trust in his love, lean on his strength, and allow him to carry you through whatever you are facing. Faith is not just a passive belief, it is an active and powerful tool in your healing journey. It's what connects you to God's promises and allows you to experience His presence even in the midst of your deepest struggles. The Bible consistently teaches us that trusting in God's goodness and sovereignty is essential, especially when life doesn't make sense and when His ways seem mysterious or beyond our understanding. Proverbs 3 verses 5 to 6 offers profound wisdom, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding, in all your ways submit to him and he will make your path straight. This verse calls you to place your full confidence in God, surrendering your need to figure everything out on your own. When you choose to trust God with all your heart, you are making a conscious decision to rely on his wisdom rather than your own. This can be challenging, especially when you are faced with pain, uncertainty, or unanswered questions. But this kind of trust opens the door for God to move powerfully in your life. It's an invitation for Him to take control, to guide you, and to work miracles in ways that only He can. Your faith allows God to lead you on a path that leads to healing and restoration, even when you can't see the way forward. Trusting in God's plan means believing that He knows what is best for you even when His timing and methods are different from what you expected or hoped for. It means holding on to the truth that God's ways are higher than our ways and His thoughts are higher than our thoughts. His timing is always perfect even when it feels delayed from our perspective. Sometimes, the process of healing is slow and requires patience, but during this time, God is working in ways that you may not fully understand or see right now. As you walk through your healing journey, let your faith be a source of strength and encouragement. Trust that God is with you every step of the way, orchestrating every detail of your healing process. He is the master healer who not only understands your pain but also knows the exact moment and method of bringing about your complete restoration. Your faith in God's goodness, power, and perfect timing will sustain you, giving you hope and peace as you wait on His miraculous work in your life. Keep trusting, keep believing, and know that God's plan for your healing is unfolding in His perfect time. Prayer is not just a routine or a ritual, it is your direct line to the healing power of God. Through prayer, you have the incredible privilege of entering into the presence of the Almighty, laying your burdens before Him, and inviting His transformative power into your life. Philippians 4 verses 6 to 7 offers a powerful reminder, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus.
This passage encourages you to bring every concern, every worry, and every need to God in prayer. It is in this act of surrender when you cast your cares on Him that you make room for His peace to flood your heart and mind. As you pray, do so with confidence, knowing that God not only hears you but is already at work on your behalf. He is not distant or disinterested, He is intimately involved in your life, caring deeply about every detail. Your prayers are powerful because they are heard by a God who is both compassionate and capable of doing far more than you can ask or imagine. When you bring your needs to Him, believe that He is moving in ways you may not yet see, orchestrating circumstances, providing strength, and guiding you toward the healing and peace you so desperately need. Finally, let God's Word be your source of comfort and strength. The Bible is not just a collection of ancient texts, it is a living, breathing testament to God's faithfulness, filled with promises that are as true today as they were when they were first written. Psalm 119 verse 50 declares, This is my comfort in my affliction, that your promise gives me life. In times of affliction, whether physical, emotional, or spiritual, God's word is a lifeline. It offers hope, wisdom, and reassurance that God is with you, working for your good even in the midst of suffering. Spend time in scripture, allowing its truths to seep into your heart and mind. When you meditate on God's promises, you equip yourself with the spiritual armor needed to face life's challenges. His word has the power to uplift you, to bring clarity where there is confusion, and to offer peace where there is turmoil. As you immerse yourself in the Bible, you will find that its promises give you life, sustaining you through even the darkest of times. Trust in the power of God's word to guide you on your healing journey, leading you to a place of wholeness and restoration. As you go through your day, hold on to the truth that God is your healer. He loves you, He cares for you, and He is more than able to heal you in every way. Trust in Him, lean on His promises, then know that your healing is in His hands. God bless you.